What's going on guys? <coughs> What's up everyone? We just had a uh, about 9-10 hour journey from Manila all the way here to Banawe. So I want you all to check out I want you all to check this out. So we're here by the veranda and the rice terrace is just there. It's nice and green. Nice and green rice terrace. Looks so good. I've, I've always wanted to see a rice terrace. At the moment, apparently, it's the best time to come because the rice terrace is nice and green and there's still um, rice on it. It's got rice, bitch, got rice, got food, got soup, got spice. So, yeah, we're just gonna go eat and enjoy this. view later on. So we're just going to have our breakfast. We're, we're planning to go to Bahad. No, we're planning to have a very extraneous day today try to fit in as much as we can in one day then go back home breakfast is good uh, Filipino breakfast for 120 pesos plus a coffee or tea or ch chocolate you get rice egg tocino vegetables and a banana So we're stood here on top of this jeepney and we got to our first view. Looks good, looks good. No, the doggy. No. Oh, nothing. We have to go down from the jeep and we have to stop as the jeep can no longer move this way. Why? There's no more roads. The road ends. The road ends over there. So we have to uh, we have to trek down. 20 minutes apparently. So uh, see you there. We've hit our stop. This is called the Mini Amphitheater of Batad. You can see that the um, it's nice. Nice. The way the rice terrace is made is nice. Still nice. Very nice. Very nice. nice. The best ones we've seen so far. So if you're ever coming here to Banawe, visit Batad. I am still in awe. I am still in awe. I'm still in awe of this place. It looks really good. Amazing. It's nice. So later we're gonna come back here to have our lunch. And while we're having lunch, we get this view. Good, right? It's nice. Just look at that. What more can I say? It's nice! I'm speechless, guys. I'm speechless. So uh, we're here, walking. We're gonna be by the rice field soon. We're actually literally by the rice fields already. This is so amazing! The waterfall is right there. No. Oh. 
This is so nice. It's nice. I can't recommend this enough. If you can get through traveling here, this is so worth it. So much worth it. Good. All right, so uh, pit stop, pit stop. We're here. Check this view out. Check this view out. Amazing, right? Amazing. Now um, we're gonna go trek down. We're gonna go trek down there to get to see the waterfalls. You know, after all this trekking from from all the way there where those buildings are to down here we're gonna go to the waterfalls to refresh ourselves so I'll uh, see you there you wouldn't believe what we just went through just to get to see this waterfalls they closed off half of the pathway so we had to go through a way which there wasn't any way at all a lot of trees basically we had to take a, take a detour around to the river there and once we were there, we couldn't even pass to go here. So we had to go up again in a pathway where I don't even know if you would call it pathway. Just someone just made it recently. But you know what? The waterfalls is here. You can probably hear it. Here's the waterfalls. It's good. It's nice. It's good. So earlier today, on the way up here, because the road over there was closed, we had to come up from up here. So tiring. It was so tiring going up from up there. Now we're on the way back. Hopefully the road's open now. So we've just been from there. Waterfalls is behind that landslide, behind there. And it was such a trek coming up here, back to where we're gonna ha we had food. Would I do it again? No, I won't do it again. It was such a trek. If they put a zip line from here to there, then probably. But I loved every minute of it. But it was so tiring. You need to be physically fit to be walking up and down. So yeah, but then I, I still recommend this place to come. Because it just looks amazing. Anyway, we're gonna go head up soon. Back to Banawe. Back to our bus van. And uh, yeah, gonna go back to Manila.